Hey guys, I'm over here at American Tire Depot. This is by far the best place to buy tires. And I've had nothing but headaches dealing with Discount Tire and Evans Tire and this other place called the Wheel Zone or whatever for the past two days. It's just been a nightmare. So right now we're getting a new set of Falcon uh, all-terrain tires put on the 4Runner. And basically these guys are taking care of me they're not only beating or not only matching like discount tire or whatever they're like beating them by over a hundred dollars for a set so basically um i'm really stoked they're taking care of it no games good price and they don't have a problem with me doing spacers because everybody else was like complaining about spacers and how they couldn't do it and whatever well these guys are doing the spacers they're installing the spacers at no charge they have no problem doing the tires and everything so i'm really stoked i'll show you guys in a second what tires i'm getting here they are freaking sidewalls are so beef like tires are just really nice one size up look really grippy. I don't know, I love the tread on them. Kind of looks like the old BFG, but a little better. Hopefully they last and they serve me well. So I went over to Four Wheel Parts earlier today and I picked up these G2 spacers. We're going to go ahead and apply them to this and the front in order to get the new wheels installed. We're putting a Tacoma wheels on it. So I went and picked up the, they're called Snowflakes, the five star Tacoma TRD Pro wheels. And we're gonna install the new tires on those wheels and use spacers to put them on here. And those I'm just taking home by itself. So that's where it's at. So there they are, they're on the car now. I think it looks really good. He said the wheels are not bent or anything, that's good. Uh, hoping it would stick out a little bit more, but we'll see how she sits on the ground. Uh, there you go, got them on. They look really good. Love new tires. It's like the best feeling. Well, there she is, all done. I really like it. Can't wait to get that live done in the front. And that should be good. Bam, over at Pan Auto now, they're gonna put my front springs on. I just got a set of Bills, no. What are they, Old Man Emu 2881s to match the back Old Man Emu 906, or 2906 to be exact. So, that's the new 32s with the used wheels that I picked up for a hundred bucks from a guy. I think they look way better than the stock wheels, but I didn't want to go anything too expensive because what's the point, it's an off-roading vehicle, right? So I have a mad rake right now. So hopefully after the lift it'll be even or the front's gonna be a slightly higher because my plan is to stick a maybe a spacer in the back, but I got pretty much a lot a lot of lift the way it is, so it should be fine. Alright, well I'm gonna show you guys the springs here in a second and we'll go from there. Yeah buddy, we're over here with Thomas at Pan Auto, my favorite place. Getting these old man emus installed, the 2881 springs. Oh, uh, we're just gonna take the stockies out and pop those in and see how she goes. This thing has stupid stock amount of flex to where he had to use wood, maxed out the jack or the lift, and the front tire is still on the ground. The back one's off the ground because the way you know the lift is made. Look how much it drooped down, it's insane. The front one still still on the ground. And I really like these wheels way better than the factory ones. I actually dig these. I'm not gonna buy aftermarket wheels for this thing anymore. Come hear the noise? Yeah, he heard it. He came from out there. <laughs> so these are the stock springs. We took them out. Those are the old man emus with the Bilstein 5100s. 
We got the G2 spacers. They are hub centric, just to verify. So they didn't balance my tires really well. I guess I'm gonna have to go back and rebalance them. But I do like these wheels. And I do like these tires. So I'm hoping that we got a little lift out of these springs. Well, here's the video. No, she's not that high. We're way off the ground. So the, the thing's going to go down. And I'm hoping, I'm hoping, I'm hoping we got a little bit of lift out of her. I'm hoping. She's on the ground. Looks so good. We got a perfect, yeah, pretty perfect lift now. Definitely went up. Most definitely it went up. Well, there she is. All done, two inch lift all the way around. I had the back already before. Like I said, now we just put the front on. Two inch lift and 32s. That's what they look like. Ready to go do some off-roading. Overall, I'm really pleased with these tires, with the wheels, with the suspension, everything. Cool, see you guys in the next one.